everyone, my name is Izzy. I am here today with Pass the Honey to show you how to make the perfect charcuterie board for the holidays, whether you are going out or staying in. So let's disassemble this to show you how to make it. So when you're thinking about buying the cheese and meat and other additions to your charcuterie board, whether it be for the holidays or just for fun, you should always buy based on your group size. I always measure it with my heart, but if you're thinking that you really wanna to stick to a budget, you should really go with two to three ounces of cheese per person and maybe three to four pieces of meat per person. Just remember, this is an hors d'oeuvre, it's not a main course. That is a good way to make it a nice and balanced plate for everybody. But a good rule of thumb as well when you're picking out those different cheeses and meats is too soft, maybe too hard, and one spreadable type of cheese, and then those extras to add in color, like strawberries or maybe some grapes or nuts, olives, things like that. And my favorite addition to a lot of these plates is honey. So honey is a perfect addition to any charcuterie board because it adds that sweetness to those pungent cheeses. So we always pick past the honey because it's a perfect addition to any charcuterie board with its single serving size and much like wine, Honeycomb's flavor palette is entirely dependent on its origin. So you get a full flavor profile just from the honey itself. And past the honey's honeycomb will always be pure, unadulterated, and ethically sourced. So now that I have raved enough about Pass the Honey and why we love honey on our charcuterie boards, I just wanted to mention as well that no charcuterie board is complete without a glass of wine and Bright Sellers can make that really easy for you by shipping personalized wine matches straight to your door to match with your personalized cheese board that you are taking to your holiday gatherings or just having at home by yourself. As always, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe so that you can stay up to date on all of our wine tips. Cheers.